we will be learning about comparative and superlative degree or adjectives which is called as ismut of deal in arabic so before we enter into our ismut of deal what we're going to do is we're just going to revise from our previous class that is fa'al mudari'a so we're just going to do a couple of verbs from group ai which is bab daraba daraba yadribu where the ain kalima will have fata in madi and ain kalima will have a kasra in mudari'a so we'll do the verb daraba daraba yadribu huwa yadribu huma yadribani hum yadribuna hiya tadribu hiya huma tadribani hunna yadribna hunna yadribna anta tadribu antuma tadribani antunna hum tadribuna anti tadribina antuma tadribani antunna tadribna antunna tadribna ana adribu nahnu nadribu so daraba means he hit yadribu means he hits he is hitting so we'll do one more word jalasa jalasa means he is sad so it will be bab daraba so it will be daraba yadribu jalasa yajlisu so if you do five in your pocket so it will be yajlisu tajlisu tajlisu ajlisu najlisu so we'll do full conjugation now yajlisu yajlisani yajlisuna hum yajlisuna hiya tajlisu huma tajlisani hunna yajlisna hunna yajlisna so the ain lam kalima will get sukoon anta tajlisu antuma tajlisani antum tajlisuna anti tajlisina antuma tajlisani antunna tajlisna antunna tajlisna ana ajlisu nahnu najlisu so we got two groups here here the file is mustatir what we call as five in your pocket and we got here nunata hai nun jata hai group which is afwal al khamsa it's called afwal al khamsa five sorry uh, five uh, special verbs and we got mabni okay mabni group where the file is attached and they don't change anything in comes in front of them so coming to comparative and superlative degree it's called ismut of deal so comparative adjectives are used when we compare between two things and superlatives are used when we compare more than two things this is a simple uh, rule how we use comparative and superlatives so for example so we got this uh, transition in english we have old older oldest young younger youngest pretty pretty or prettiest you know if good better best so there are different ways how you use to compare and you have a superlative degrees so in comparative the word than is appears in sentences for example if you say ahmed is smarter than bilal hamid is stronger than ali she is taller than her so wherever we are comparing between two we use the word than in english okay and in superlatives we use the word the to specify for example if you say hamid is the oldest he is a superlative and there will be a definite article the so that gives like a a superlative adjective hamid is the oldest man akbar is the tallest man that shade of blue is the most beautiful so we use a superlative along with a definite article so how do we do make comparative and superlative in arabic so which is ismut of deal so ismut of deal comes on a pattern in arabic it's very very simple it's very easy this only one pattern and that pattern is called af'alu af'alu that's the pattern for comparative and superlative degree so any noun for example if you say jamilun so if you make it in this pattern af'alu it will be ajmalu ajmalu so if you say hasanun it will be ahsanu so that's the pattern where we use for comparative and superlative degrees for
for any noun it will have this pattern so now how do we know in a sentence which is talking about comparing or it is talking about superlative so if we have this pattern afalu followed by immediately it is followed by an ism majroor okay like a pattern of mudaf mudaf ilahi so we have afalu followed by ism majroor that is a noun that has kasra and that is a superlative okay for example if we say ibrahim ahsanu talibin ibrahim ahsanu talibin say ahsanu is the pattern afalu is the best student fil madras day in the school so when we translate afalu pattern now and immediately there is a ism majroor then we say use a superlative that is the best student ibrahim is the best student so if the same afalu noun which is followed by min which is followed by min then that is a a comparative degree here min it does not have the same meaning as from so normally we know it's in harf jar which means from but here in this ismut of deel pattern where we compare it has a meaning of than like how we said hamid is taller than bilal so min replaces than in arabic for example if you say bilalun atwalu bilal is taller min aminata say min aminata so after min there always is some much rule there's no change in that relationship but however when there is a ismut of til followed by min then it is becomes a comparative sentence so bilal is taller than amina so that's the two ways how we identify whether it is superlative or comparative so this noun afalu it has got certain characteristics so what are the characteristics so if we look here it has got single dhamma and we know any noun with a single dhamma and the pattern of afalu like we've done before ahmaru asgharu so this all pattern is a diptote is a mamnu aminas Sarf. so that means it doesn't take kasra okay so this is smooth of deal doesn't take kasra and second characteristic of ismut of deal is one form whether the noun which it is describing it is singular or plural we will use just afalu if it say and the third is it is unisex which means it is used for both male and female nouns it is used the same pattern afalu you don't have a male version and you don't have a female version so it's just afalu so these are the main characteristics of ismut of this is tipped out is used for both singular and plural nouns and is used for both male and female nouns for example bilalu atwalu min amina so bilal we're talking about a masculine noun and that's like an adjective is taller than amina so if you want to switch it around we should say amina tu atwalu min bilal so here we're using a muzak muannath noun but we still use the pattern afalu we don't have afala tu so it is just one pattern afalu amina tu afalu min atwalu min bilalin so just to catch up is afalu followed by ism majroor is superlative and afalu followed by min will be comparative so we're going to do some examples like tawilun it will be atwalu kabirun will be akbaru nadifun which is mean clean we answer for the cleanest sahlun easy ashalu the easiest saghirun small asgharu is the smallest so we're going to do some sentences just to give us some practice so if you see here it says hada al kitab hada muqtada followed by al is badal so we say this book hada al kitab ashalu ashalu is your khabar and then you have jar majru so then we have ism of deel ashalu min so ashalu is followed by min that means comparative so this book is easier than zaka zaka means 
that is uh, short form of dhalika where lam is missing so it's, it's also called dhaka hadha al-kitab ashalu min dhaka so hadhi sayyaratu see now we have feminine so hadhi is manishara muqtada followed by al which is badal so this car hadhi sayyaratu ajmalu see ajmalu because it is a khabar one word and then it is mutafteel followed by min so it is beautiful than tilka than that this car is beautiful than that so hamzatu akbaru minni this is here here we are telling comparing hamza to our myself here in this sentence it says hamza is bigger than me so now we have got another noun here to see sinnan so we got a mansub noun indefinite singular so what is this so we've used this type of noun after kam like kam taliban fil fasli so what it's got called it was called as tamiz tamiz is a noun which clears the ambiguity so if you're telling here hamza to is bigger than me in what way so here we'll say we'll bring a tamiz to clarify the sentence so that is called tamiz so you can say has hamza to akbaru minni malan is bigger than me in money so those are that's called a tamiz so next sentence ha ulai tulab si ha ulai is mo ishara followed by al is badal is muqtada ahsanu so here is called plural but here we still be using the ahsanu we don't have any plural form of afalu so is ahsanu min ulaika these students or better than those baiti is mudaf mudaf ilai baitu plus ya mudakallim okay mudaf mudaf ilai my house is ab'adu ab'adu comes from ba'idun that means far so we have learned before that ba'id always comes with an and qareeb always comes with min so we got ab'adu again it will have the same preposition which is coming an so you hear the sentence is baiti my house ab'adu anil madrasati is far from the school than baituka than your house so baiti ab'adu anil madrasati min baitika so mean baitika so we know it is is a majrur so it will be baiti and it will be ka mudaf ilahi mudaf mudaf ilahi so again here huwa asgharu minna he is smaller than us so how is he smaller than us in sinna so this is a tamiz to clarify the ambiguity khatti khatti is again the combination of mudaf mudaf ilahi khattun means handwriting khattu plus ya mutakallim mudaf mudaf ilahi khatti is my writing ahsanu min khatti ka my handwriting is better than your handwriting hada shari'u see hada mubtada ash-shari'u means street badal this street anzafu this comes from nadifun anzafu is cleaner so do you use cleanest or cleaner we use cleaner because it's followed by min so it is be comparative anzafu min dhalika is cleaner than that so here we will use the superlative form he say muhammadun talibun hasanun so that's the sentence a normal jumlat al-ismiya muhammad al-muqtada talibun one word khabar hasanun is na'at so how do we make it like a ismut of deel so always in ismut of deel the na'at becomes the ismut of deel so that will come first and then followed by a ism majroor so it will be muhammadun ahsanu talibin see the best student fil fasli in class hadha baytun jameelun again simple to the ismia so how do we make it into ismat of deel hadha ajmalu baytin the most beautiful house fish share in the street aminatu talibatun saghiratun so aminatu so saghiratun so we'll have the same pattern as asgharu whether it is masculine or feminine it's the same form afalu so we use asgharu 
طول باتن في المدرسة تي so if you see this follow this examples here هذه غرفة صغيرة so how do we make it هذه so صغيرة is the not so we have to make it اسم تفضيل so that will come first هذه أصغر أصغر غرفة followed by اسم مجرور okay so here it is هذه غرفة because it is خبر it is مرفو we know this and this is صغيرة because it is نعم so here it is هذه أصغر غرفة في بيتنا it is the smallest room in our house بلال لاعب لاعب means player حسن is the best okay it's a good good player so if you want to make it like a اسم تفضيل it will be بلال أحسن لاعب أحسن لاعب في فريقنا فريق means team فريق means team نا is مضاف إليه is فريق plus نا but because it is حرف شر before so في فريق نا so بلال is the best player in our team ياسر رجل فقير ياسر is a poor man so how do you make اسم تفضيل ياسر أفقر فقير will be أفقر رجل في قريتنا again في قريتنا is مضاف مضاف إليه so ياسر is the poorest man in قرية means village our village هذه ساعة رخيصة so this watch is cheap so how do you make اسم تفضيل هذه أرخص ساعة في السوق in the shopping complex so this is how we use superlative and comparative so inshallah we will continue with this lesson in our next class so write and practice and inshallah we will be stronger assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi